Welcome to Excel Basics video number 13. Hey, if you want to download this workbook and follow along, click on my YouTube channel, then click on my College Upside link, and you can download the workbook, Excel Basics. Hey, in 13 here, I want to talk about percentage format. <clears throat> Just in the last video, we talked about number formatting, and we saw date math, how to calculate uh, the hours worked, and how to calculate days past due for invoice dates. But here we want to talk about a, uh, a different uh, formatting, same, same idea, the number formatting, but we want to talk about percentages. All right now I'm going to scroll down here and type in some labels here. I'm going to say uh, type 0 0.03 in cell, then format. Now what we're going to see here is probably the number one uh, most common formatting mistake that you see in Excel. All right? Let's type in point zero three and then what it means by point and then format is to then format it. Right? Control one is the keyboard shortcut and then we apply percentage. Notice we have a sample. It says three percent. So we typed in point zero three uh, and then format it. Now we're going to do the same thing. I'm going to copy this down and change this 0 0.03 to 3. And here's where people get into trouble. They type in 3, control enter. That is 3. That's 3 times more than 100%, right? Number the number 1 is 100%. But here's what they do. They type this 3 and then they go control 1 and they click on the percentage and they're shocked when they get 300%. And that's it. If you type if you're gonna put a number in and then format it, you have to type 0 .03 because that really is what's in the cell. Um, if um, we, these we typed in the number and then format it, but if you pre-format them, which we will do here, I'm going to highlight those two cells and then control one and I'm going to pre-format them and I'm going to type a label over here. Pre format with percentage uh, number format. Now watch what happens when we type in 3. As soon as we type in 3, that percentage symbol pops up telling you that it's pre-formatted. So it'll take that 3 and say, forget it, I know you want 0 .03. Now, but watch this. If you type 0 .03, remember that cell is pre-formatted. It will do the same. It'll do the same thing. It'll it'll take. Uh, in both cases, it'll show you three percent formatted, and in the cell will be 0 .03. Now, if you don't believe that that's really uh, what's in the cell, Control One, and then go back to General. Click OK, and you can see it's 0 .03. Same with here. If I click here, Control 1, go back to General, you see it's 0 .03. I'm going to Control ZZ. Uh, the last uh, thing we want to look at here for in regards to percent is what happened. It's called uh, Format as you type. And that way with, um, and sometimes it's convenient to do that with percentages. Watch this. This cell is not preformatted, and I'll prove it to you. Control one. It says general. So now watch this. Three point zero zero and a percentage symbol. That's called formatting as you type. That way we typed in the number and the uh, format as we went. But really, don't forget what's really in the cell is point zero three. So that's very important. Uh, things to know about the percentage format. All right, we'll see you next basic video. Don't forget, if you want to download the workbooks that you see at Excel is Fun, you just on the left of the Excel is Fun channel, click on this link right here, and there's the workbooks for uh, this video series. There's a book you can download for free and all the other workbooks you can find uh, for all the other videos I have posted at uh, YouTube. And there's the direct link if you want that. All right, we'll see you next trip.